Judy Garland would have been 100 years old this month. Grammy-nominated singer-songwriter Rufus Wainwright is honoring her back in 2007 to celebrate the music and uh, films of that icon. He re-recorded her 1961 album, Judy, at Carnegie Hall. And tonight and tomorrow, he's going to be at the City Winery here in Chicago to perform it live. I've listened to that clip a half a dozen times. Uh, it gives me goosebumps every Aww. time. This whole album is just uh, so um, kind of mesmerizing <laughs> to listen to. And it's gotten me so curious. You've been like kind of mesmerized yourself with Judy yes. and performing her songs. Uh, going back to about 2007 when you yeah. recreated her Carnegie Hall show at Carnegie Hall. Right? Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, I, I, I've been a lifelong fan of Judy Garland's since uh, we used to watch the, you know, the Wizard of Oz, uh, of Oz every year on television, the whole family, so it started then. But yeah, no, when I did uh, the Carnegie Hall concert and then subsequently um, did a 10th anniversary of that, and then this is... Uh, for her 100th birthday. What's nice about this this in, in, in iteration is that it's it's very intimate. I don't do it with like a huge orchestra or a big band. I just have like a, a trio playing with me, and it's, a, it's a, it is that much more mesmerizing because you're kind of really getting I think into it, the it, song. Like, really draws you. Yeah, into you're it really getting into sort of the minutia like of the songs. And I got and I recorded it at Capitol Records where she worked, and I actually used her very own microphone. That's, so that's, that's, that's cool. a, just maybe I'm just you know too much of a music <laughs> industry dork, but I think that's so cool that yeah. uh, you recorded probably in a studio where Frank yes. Sinatra or the Beatles may have recorded, yeah, yeah, yeah. but also where Judy Garland did that's with her life. microphone. Do, does that? Uh, what does that do to a performer when he's um, in those well, kind of yeah, surroundings? Well, it's, yeah, it's, 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 they're large sort of ruby slippers to fill, <laughs> <laughs> for sure. But I think, you know, I'm not trying to top her or anything. I, it's, I think in a lot of ways it's, it's probably easier for me because I'm a gay man. So, so it's sort of, if anything, it's sort of, you know, really paying homage to like a, a, a real important figure in, in the LGBTQ community. It's also Pride Month here, or at least it was in California. But uh, still loose but, okay, okay. <laughs> so, so, so. Anyway, so I, um, so I think I think it comes off as very sincere. Um, I think if I ever, if, if it was ever something, if I was trying to top her or like be, you know, you know, equal her in any way, it would yeah. be kind of silly. Truly, truly, an homage. <laughs> what is it about yeah. her? her music or her yeah, performances yeah, yeah. Uh, that still rings so... Well, I think on one hand, there's, there's, a, there's a real sort of honesty to them um, matched equally with this otherworldly kind of Hollywood dream uh, slash nightmare situation where, where you, you know, you see this little girl uh, singing, but you also see this very troubled woman, you know, at the same time. So there's just, it's just very dramatic and also very, very pure in a way. Yeah, you've been performing the show in other cities in New York and uh, L.A. Yeah. And celebrities are coming out like crazy, yeah, right? Yeah, to yeah. No, we had, we had. Be special, there, but also yeah, perform well, we, you with know, you. Yeah, well, we had, we had guests in New York um, for each show. I didn't have time. I, I was going to call Jennifer Hudson. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Uh, which I, 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 I sillily did not get around to um, Jennifer. If you want to come <laughs> sing a song, you're <laughs> totally welcome. But uh, but uh, but yeah. But this. But but I'm. Uh, yeah. No. We've had some fun people come down, like my friend Molly Ringwald and people like that. I know Lorna Luft, oh, Judy's yes. uh, daughter, performed with you. Yes. Uh, what's been the reaction from the family? Any reaction from Liza? Uh, well, I mean, Lorna and I are, are very close, and, uh, and 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 we we adore each other. Liza is 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 is, is a different sort of animal. She's very. I think she's very, she's worked so hard to create her own yeah. um, legendary status that I think stuff with her mother is, is tricky. So, so, so it's, it's easier with Lorna. Yeah. So, <laughs> so how, how does the show work exactly? It's doing two shows tonight, two shows tomorrow. Yeah, two. But you kind of you yeah. kind of split it up. The, yeah. The whole no. Concert, what, right? what it is, we do an early show and a late show at the City Winery, uh, and uh, the first show is the first half of the concert, and the second show is the second half. So if you want to see the whole kit and caboodle come see both shows but it's um but yeah but it's uh 
But you'll, you'll still get to the big numbers, you know, the, the, that, uh, that, that one would expect. Yeah. What else is going well. on with you besides uh, the, the Judy show? Yeah, well, right after this, I'm off to England, and I'm doing Glastonbury, the, the, that rock festival in England. And then they're doing my opera, Hadrian, in Spain, in Madrid, and in Barcelona at the end of July. So I'm going, you know, jazz, rock, and then opera. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of the things I like about your music so much. I mean, you really, you yeah, know, as much yeah. as I would love to put you in a cubbyhole yeah. somewhere, uh, yeah. uh, you kind of defy. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm copy list. That is for you, sure. You are. That is yeah. for sure. Is that, it's it's got to be a little more fun as a performer. It's fun. Right? It's tougher to you know market, shall we say? I've always had trouble, you know, figuring out what slot to put me in in terms of the record store. But there are no more record stores, so. <laughs> right. Doesn't make any difference, right? It's all so, online right yeah, now, right? So, so. Well, the uh, the shows are. Uh, it's uh, uh, Rufus Wainwright. Rufus Ooh. does Judy. Tonight and Friday, tonight and tomorrow at the City Winery, 1200 West Randolph Street uh, in Chicago. You can get more information and tickets at citywinery.com. Rufus Wainwright, thank you so much for joining us. Thank Good to you. See you. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Hey, my